Yeah, Craig, no chance of snow here, right? No. <laughs> No, there's not going to be any snow. As a matter of fact, there's not even a chance of rain for it today. Look at the sky, how it cleared from when we first started this morning. And we saw all those clouds that were just drifting around just about at, at uh, the, the tops of the buildings there. They're gone. All the clouds are gone out there. Temperature 50 degrees. It's now brighter. It is going to feel like spring all day. Rain does return in the forecast, which will be great for the flowers. And I want to thank my producer, Matt, for getting this up there real quick. This is on the south side of my house the, the the southern exposure there look at the crocus already coming up they're not waiting for springtime that looks like hyacinth right there a little burn on the top maybe from the cold weather but yeah they're they're all coming up daffodils and everything spring the actual beginning of spring is only 16 days away and next weekend remember that we are pushing the clocks ahead one hour so we'll lose a little bit of sleep but we're going to gain the daylight at the end of the afternoon today it'll set the sun will set at about 550 or so in one week it's setting closer to seven o'clock and in four weeks it's setting well after seven o'clock we're making progress uh, I mean yes snow could still be in the forecast but we're making progress here it's all clear now it's going to be nice and sunny for the afternoon take a look down here down towards Florida this high pressure keeps us uh, you know nice for today but down here that rainfall is going to be the area that moves right on up the coastline rather than going on out to sea so why Watch it evolve as we uh, move this along here on Futurecast. See the storm developing there? Takes all that moisture, wraps it around, and now it's moving on up. And by the time we get to Tuesday morning's commute, that's not pretty. I mean, that's more rain for Tuesday morning's commute, and that's just part of the deal here. That system could give us another half inch to an inch of rain, and when you combine what's coming along for the rest of the week, there could be three, four inches of rain before this week is done. 62 for today. The uh, record is 65. Some of you are going to do it. I could see parts of New Jersey for sure will be able to do that. And here's the seven-day forecast with our 62 today, 65 is the record as we said tomorrow a little bit lower because there will be more clouds but still it's in the upper 50s and then after that monday night into tuesday the flowers will be getting a good drink <laughs> for the beginning of the spring season as they're all starting to pop up because there's a chance of rain tuesday another round wednesday into thursday a break friday and then perhaps mo even more on saturday so far it doesn't look like so that's a good thing and actually, yeah. it looks like we have two good days, right? Today and tomorrow, maybe? Uh, uh, well, it'll be dry, but the clouds will come in, so it won't be quite as nice as today. Today's just going to be perfect, you know, especially after yesterday. I'm well, I greedy. like that your green thumb was showing, and we got to see your garden. So yeah. is, is the rain good for oh, that? This is, I mean, you're, you're great with that crocus explaining how it's looking. Right? Oh, this, 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 this is my other hobby for sure. I'll, I'll be out there, you know, probably this afternoon gardening oh, nice. already. Get, nice. the, get, get the season started. We look forward to pictures. <laughs> okay. Well.